Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm going to be reading for the sign of Aquarius. My name is Natalie. This is a general reading, so this may or may not resonate with you guys. Um, if it doesn't, uh, check your birth placements or your uh, your birth placement. Well, yeah, your birth chart, the other placements in your birth chart. Okay, your moon and Venus signs. But if this does resonate with you, go ahead and hit that like button, okay? Everything else about this reading will be in the description box below. Okay, including on how to book me for a personal reading, okay? I just need three cards for Aquarius, please. Someone rise the Venus signs. Give me three cards for Aquarius. All right, so we have death. I am learning that endings are merely beginnings. Calm down. I'm not saying anyone's going to die. This is a good death, I'm feeling. Like, it's a death to self. It's like endings are happening okay we have relationships i'm attracted to those people who serve my higher good you guys could be ending a relationship and starting another relationship here we have imagination i embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my ma my mind all right so we have manifestation going on i'm hearing manifestation going for you maybe you manifested a death to a relationship and started a new one why is the death card here? Hmm? Why is the death card here for Aquarius? Someone rising a Venus sign. Alright, so we have courthouse. Something happened in court, maybe. Alright, so we have marriage. So, it doesn't have to be a marriage situation for all of you, but it could be a situation that maybe felt like a marriage to you. It's like the final... Hmm, it's like the final say... It's like you you know that it has to happen this way or they know. Or maybe you both know. Why is relationships here for Aquarius? Someone rising Venus signs. So we have unexpected income. Maybe you have an unexpected person coming in. Mature woman at the bottom of the deck. Either you're a masculine that has a mature woman coming in. Or there's a masculine looking at a feminine as if she is a mature woman. And they're coming in very unexpectedly here. Tell me about imagination here for Aquarius, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Pathway. So it's like you're on this dream journey by yourself. We have bad health here. That it could be, yeah, that's somebody else here. Someone's in their head about you, Aquarius. Or you could be in your head about someone else. Take it how it resonates. Okay. That's what I'm seeing. So that's what I'm going to say. Okay. So um, I really feel like the energy right now is that you are manifesting a new connection here. I really feel that way with this relationship card. It, it could be coming in very unexpected for you at first. And then you realize they were under your nose. In the past, you ended something. Um, you made a final judgment call on a relationship. You don't want to deal with a certain person anymore. And that's that for you. You deaded the situation, right? Okay. What do you have for Aquarius? Someone in a sign. What's the energy right now for the sign of Aquarius? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. All right. What do we have for the sign of Aquarius? What do we have for Aquarius? Someone raising a Venus sign, splitting the deck into three. Cutting the deck at the bottom. For Aquarius, we have the Six of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. Uh, someone being very nostalgic. Someone's being very nostalgic. Okay. Knight of Swords here. Air energy. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Air energy again with the Ace of Swords. Mm, we have the Three of Swords, Libra Energy. We have the Queen of Wands here, Aries, Leo, Sag. King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. So we have a match here. We have the Four of Swords here. The Devil, Capricorn Energy. And then we have the Three of Pentacles here. Hmm. 
was I just saying you just ended a situation? Yeah. You ended a, a situation with someone that hurt you. They're very toxic. And you have to heal now. And you don't got time for this person's stuff. You don't got time for this person's energy. This person is very toxic. But we do have a match here. King and Queen of uh, Wands here. Both of them are very passionate about what they want to do in their lives. Both of them are very powerful, though. I just heard that. Both of them are very powerful. This person is very po This masculine energy is very powerful in how they um, execute their toxic deeds. And then we have the feminine energy, very very powerful in uh, discerning truth and um, um, what's the word here? She could be in some sort of um, club, some sort of club that is highly looked upon, or maybe she works somewhere that is very um, productive for her, and she knows how to cut things out. I'm not even clarifying it, and I'm already telling too much. Tell me about this Knight of Swords here for Aquarius, someone rising in Venus signs, Knight of Swords for Aquarius. Alright, so we have the Page of Wands, a very, um, a very immature, not immature, what's the word I'm looking for? It's a good start. It's a good start for a message, but not exactly, because they're coming off as the Knight of Swords here, Two of Cups. They do want to come in and they want to send you a message about this connection. Um, here's the thing, I think you're just... Whoever the Queen of Wands is, because we have a King and the Queen, whoever the Queen of Wands is, Wands is, she's very clear about what she wants right now, and she's very confident. But here's the thing, you guys met your match because this person is also very confident, but they're very toxic. Or maybe they, um, they're just around someone that is, or maybe they're, I don't know, I can't, let's see. Why is the devil here for Aquarius, someone rising Venus signs? nine of wands they're very guarded all right you're, you're just guard i don't know what's happening with this with this person and why they're so toxic all i know is that they're guarded and you're guarded too right now i feel like you're trying to heal someone is trying to protect themselves they don't want to seem vulnerable they don't want to seem vulnerable, so they s sort of end things here. That's their toxic trait. That's for some of you. But all in all, the devil can mean anything toxic, really. Um, tell me about the Ace of Swords here for Aquarius, Someone Rising, Venus Signs. <sighs> the devil. You're cutting out this toxic energy. You don't want this toxic energy anymore. There you go. King of Swords. He's very narcissistic. Somebody's narcissistic here. I feel it. Because it's toxic energy. And then the King of Swords just popped up. This person is from your past. The person that you're done with right now. They're coming back. And they're coming back as your match. But... I really feel like this queen of, queen of Wands knows what they're doing. Tell me about the Three of Swords here for Aquarius, Someone Rising Venus Signs. Why is the Three of Swords here for Aquarius? The Empress. Alright, so we have the Hangman here. This person sees things from a, a different perspective right now. Um, they realize that they hurt someone that was their empress here the only thing we're missing is the emperor we already have a match here but i really feel like this person is they gotta deal with something here it could be them or it could be someone around them or it could just be their fear of of relationships that makes this toxic this person i'm not getting any type of abusive energy i'm just getting that they're coming off pretty uh abusive when it comes to this relationship out of their own fear and they start things very small. 
Tell me about the King of Wands here for Aquarius, someone rising Venus signs. Why is the King of Wands here? Four of Swords, Four of Swords. Knight of Wands. They think they can heal it. This toxic person think that they thinks that they can heal this. But the Queen of Wands is very clear. She said she doesn't want this anymore. She defeated this devil already. So why are you coming back? Alright, tell me about the Queen of Wands here for Aquarius, someone rising Venus signs. Very interesting energy here. We have the Justice card here. Yeah, it's only right that you heal after this person did whatever the heck they just did. Maybe they just said something that just, you, maybe and you were just like, you know what, that's it. I got to go heal now. Thanks a lot. And it's the right thing to do right now because you don't have to deal with, that's an injustice. There was an injustice that happened here. This person in the past. Um, you could be dealing with a past life soulmate here, but this person really needs to, um, if they intend on healing this, they got to do this the right way. Give me the three uh, pentacles here for Aquarius, please. Someone rising Venus signs. Three pentacles for Aquarius, please. Ace of Wands. Yeah, they gotta they gotta put in the actual work for this. There's that six of cups again, soulmate energy. It's like they think about the past and how things used to be, or you guys both think about the past and how things used to be, and they wanna start this all over again. Brand new start. It's like the they wanna start all the all over again with this. Four swords, please, for Aquarius. Why is the four swords here for Aquarius? Four of Swords, please, for Aquarius. Temperance. They think they can fix it. They want to fix it. Queen of Cups, they want to express their emotions to you. They want to express something to you, Aquarius. They want to start something brand new here. Now, do they have the potential for it? Um, I think so. Yeah, you guys are a match for sure. I feel like you guys can put, you guys can be a power couple, I'm hearing. They just did something wrong here. You guys could have children together. I just heard for some of you. Okay. I need three cards for Aquarius, please. Someone ride me Venus signs. Three cards for Aquarius. All right, so we have the solar plexus chakra. That has a lot to do with confidence. Yeah, you guys are a power couple. All right, so we have prosperity begins. They see prosperity with you guys. And we have love begins. Ooh. So that's some good news here. This person might. All right, so we have triumph at the bottom of the deck. Triumph always come, overcomes the devil. So I feel maybe this person is going to overcome their... Uh, devil-like energy they're gonna put down their walls with you and um, embrace the fact that this is a power couple and um, this has a lot of potential they see you as a soulmate right all right uh, Aquarius that was your guys is reading I hope it resonated for you if it did go ahead and like subscribe share to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos and I will see you guys in your next reading namaste bye